Hey everybody, Jeff Archman here. Well, we are now on to episode 21 for season 3 of Star vs. Force of Evil. Ponymonium? Ponymonium. Oh god, we're gonna see Pony's place. That or Pony's gonna start a pseudo-apocalypse. Or both. To be honest, given Ponyhead's tendencies, it would not surprise me in the slightest. So, let's dive on in and see what we've got here for Ponymonium. If that's not the doorbell, what was that? Honey, Good to see you, girl. Check out what I brought. Oh, my goodness. That is the boringest casserole I have ever seen, girl. Maybe this night might not be a total disaster after all. <laughs> right? I've been trying to spare you from my sisters. I really have. But at this point, I need backup. What? You've always been so nice to me. You do not know them like I do, Star. They are like peanut butter and jelly. They have been trying to take me down for years, all because I'm next in line for the throne. Not to mention that I'm so beautiful and talented and humble. Uh-huh. Oh, I'm sure they're not that bad. Star, look at me. They are long face, two face, monster. Oh, this should be good. Okay, listen up, people. Okay, my friend Star is here for a meal. And we are going out like normal. Like a not like a normal. Oh, it's a snot nose baby. Like normal. <laughs> he has this. No, okay? That is not normal. This is what I'm talking about, people. Oh, no, it's fine. You guys don't have to do anything special for me. Just act like I'm not even here. Fair enough. I forgot everyone's names. Oh, hey, Star forgot y'all's names. <laughs> Your brain cells since the last song. Well, there you go. Huh. Oh, Tony Hawk, isn't it a stick a trap and into this cupcake that's on a plate here? Yeah, that's Tita's plate. She ran off. We always make a plate for her in the hopes that she'll come back one day. Yeah, don't and touch the plate then. Oh, she probably ran off because she can't stand your sorry butt, okay? She ran off because you're always throwing her shade, Ponyhead. She's always throwing me shade by doing her homework and then being like, oh, I'm going to donate to charity. You know what I mean? Like, let's throw your room, right? <laughs> so I'm not saying she's up. We wanted to play some of our original music for Star. Aww. Nobody wants to hear your creepy singing except for dead people. Are we at a haunted house? Is that I don't know. I think it's kind of sweet. I Tina. How do you even know who Tina is? You were a zygote when she disappeared. Wow, going for the cold shoulder, even though you have Daddy, no shoulders. Guess what's in the casserole? That I made. Seriously? <laughs> just take a wild guess. Now, right, I'll just 
tell you. Uh oh. Gingerbread and ice cream. Why are you going to eat it with my sister since you think they're so great? Oh, fine. This casserole is delicious, Star. Yeah. I know. Wish Baldi had named you too. I don't get it. It seems like she just hooked out of nowhere. <sighs> don't beat yourself up about it. She's like that all the time. You haven't picked up on that yet? I guess she can sometimes be a little bit of a party pooper. We know. She's pooped in our parties more times than I can even count. <sighs> and then she makes fun of me because I don't know all of her numbers yet. Aww. We all did. She messed us up real good. It's true. Because of Ponyhead's attitude, I became terribly insecure, and now I have to compensate by putting all of my self-worth into my jaw-dropping beauty. It's really hard, you guys. And I do it every day. Every day. I never know Pony had to be so horrible. But at least we have each other. Yeah. We don't need no stinking pony head to have a good time. We can show you how a real pony head parties. Now you know fans. Thanks, Francis. You start. Check this out. <laughs> oh, cool. Fun tricks. <laughs> huh? What do you think? I wasn't doing it. Huh? I'm not sure what just happened there. You should be honored. She only does that for her sisters. <laughs> you're, you're totally like one of the family now. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, yay! I've always wanted sisters. You know, it's the most awesomest thing about having sisters. Are you giving up with her note? That's a good guess, but it's actually the secret. Oh, this should be good. Do you like secret? You? <laughs> Do you like projects? We've got this super secret project we've been working on, and we'd love to get your thoughts on it. Sweet! Okay, this Check should be good. Wait, Tita on ice? I thought Tita ran off. Oh, baby, we're hatching a plot to depose Ponyhead as heir to the throne. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> You saw how she is. She's unfit to lead. Yeah, but we got it all figured out. Pony law states that if a pony princess puts one of her sisters on ice, she can never be queen. So we're putting Tina on ice and freeing pony in for it. On ice? Well, that sounds fun. No, 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 honey. We mean on, on ice. Like dead? No, 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 no. Hey, you guys, ice is supposed to be cool. And what you're talking about is bad ice. Not really. We just want to put on Tita's on ice. Ain't that right, Tita? Yeah, they got a new life set up for me and everything. I have a mustache. What you think, Star? I got a lot of questions. I know, Ponyhead has got some issues. <laughs> Maybe framing her. Not much. <gasps> Everyone knows Pony would be the worst queen ever. She just won't admit it to herself. This way, the right pony gets to inherit the throne. And. <laughs> Wait a minute. There we go. Who said you were going to be queen? Though? Yeah, I thought I was going to be queen. Amanda? Amanda? Really? No, you're. Wait. Uh, I should be queen. No, I should be queen. I'm perfect. No, I should be queen. I think I, I do the job. That makes no sense. You're supposed to be dead. We talked about this. Where are you off to in such a hurry? Oh, oh me, me? You weren't planning on telling Ponyhead now, were you? Nope. No. No, 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 no. No, because uh, we can't allow you to snitch, sugar burger. You're one of us now. Sister. <laughs> and you're gonna get disappeared too. Just like Tita. Bam! You are busted! Hey! What is going on? 
star, you beautiful angel. I'm so sorry you've been put through this trauma, girl. I knew these no class having wannabe queens were up to something. I just didn't know what. And now I have it all on video. This way, the right pony gets to inherit the throne. Okay. Thanks for having me. Because I definitely feel like I've been had. Yep. <laughs> Every meal? You have one of the best sisters a girl could ever need. Because you got me. Me okay. guy. Uh huh. Aww, oh, Dorian. Star, you weren't trying to leave without saying goodbye, were you? <laughs> Sorry, King Pony Head. You gotta stay with them. Yeah. She's a don't worry when it's night cause she will keep the lights on Oh, there goes a shining star Evil won't deter her cause magic flows through her She is a shining star Right, so that was Ponymonium and uh, they plot each other's overthrowing every single meal. Right. This episode should have been called Game of Ponies. <laughs> oh god. But uh, yeah. Interesting way to introduce us to the Ponyhead family. Jaffa Archfiend, out.